Hei hei Sobat Expert dimanapun kalian berada ketemu lagi dengan saya Denny Mahardianto bekerja di Microsoft sebagai Master Trainer Expert Zone Indonesia Ia akan memberdayakan setiap orang, setiap organisasi di planet ini untuk mencapai hal yang lebih. Kali ini kita akan sedikit ngebahas tentang bagaimana teman-teman bisa dengan mudah melakukan redeem produk key yang teman-teman miliki. Kalau zaman dulu kita beli produk Microsoft itu disertai dengan kotak, CD, dan produk key. Nah hari ini semua produk key yang akan teman-teman dapatkan itu bisa dikirimkan menggunakan email. Dan teman-teman nanti akan mendapatkan satu buah PDF yang dikirimkan menggunakan alamat email yang teman-teman punya. Jadi itu lebih mudah teman-teman menggunakan produk ini. Tanpa banyak basa-basi lagi, yuk kita langsung lihat tutorialnya berikut ini. If you've used Office for a long time, you probably remember buying an Office disk and product key and storing them in a safe place after installation in case you needed to reinstall. As long as you had your product key, you could install and activate Office on a new device. This is the way things worked for a long time. But times have changed, and we've modernized how Office is licensed and activated. Today, when you buy the latest versions of Office or Microsoft 365, some stores provide a card with your product key on it. For other stores, your product key might be printed on your receipt or sent an email. Once you have your product key, you enter it at microsoft365.com slash setup, and your new Office product is added to your Microsoft account. If you don't have a Microsoft account, you can create one. Now that you've used your product key, you no longer need it. Instead, your Microsoft account becomes your key to installing and activating your Office products. This is why it's important to remember the email address and password for your Microsoft account. Your Microsoft account is used to access account.microsoft.com slash services, where you can install Office. Your Microsoft account is also used to activate Office, which you do by signing in when prompted. With Office and your Microsoft account, you can start creating your best work. Dan itu dia tadi tutorialnya, teman-teman. Mudah kan? Waktunya kita bilang easy for us. Terima kasih yang sudah menonton. Semoga konten ini bermanfaat buat teman-teman semua. Jangan lupa tetap stay tune terus di Expert Zone Indonesia. Ada di Youtube, Facebook. Dan jangan lupa untuk like, comment, dan follow konten-kontennya. Saya Denny, pamit undur diri. Dadah!